We conducted a study to evaluate concentrations of dieldrin in the livers of river otters from Illinois. So why would we study this in otters in the first place? Well, for one thing, otters are back in Illinois waters. After a century of near extirpation, otters are thriving once again due to the recovery efforts of the Illinois Department of Natural Resources. Ot otters are also apex consumers, or top predators. They are our fellow fish-eating mammals and can accumulate high concentrations of dieldrin. So what is dieldrin? Dieldrin is a banned insecticide. It's also the primary breakdown product of a banned insecticide called aldrin. Dieldrin and aldrin were first formulated from a waste product of synthetic rubber. Aldrin was applied with great intensity to Illinois corn soil. Dieldrin was applied for the eradication of the Japanese beetle in Illinois as well. In Silent Spring, Rachel Carson detailed the application of dieldrin in Illinois and the subsequent efforts of the Illinois natural history biologists who had to operate on a financial shoestring in order to measure the damage to wildlife. Carson recounted the efforts of Thomas Scott, Yule Willis, and Jack Ellis, who documented virtual annihilation of wildlife in Sheldon, Illinois, after an application of dieldrin. In addition, from 1966 to 1981, Havera and Duzan analyzed the brains of raptors from Illinois and concluded that dieldrin was physiologically the most serious contaminant. Today, it is the sublethal concentrations of dieldrin that are of great concern. Findings are mixed. However, concentrations, exposure to concentrations of dieldrin has been associated with a wide range of serious diseases. Dieldrin is also a developmental neurotoxicant. Optimum brain development requires an astonishingly complex movement of and communication between neurons, and damage inflicted during this time has little potential for later repair. So, our sample included 15 male and 8 female river otters salvaged by the Illinois Department of Natural Resources from 2009 to 2011. We conducted necropsies at the veterinary lab at the UIUC, and samples were analyzed at Michigan State University. We detected a mean concentration of 174 parts per billion dieldrin. This is higher than the mean concentration that was reported from river otters in Illinois 25 years ago. However, at the time of that study, otters in Illinois primarily occurred in the far northwest corner of the state. Therefore, there are likely differences in our sampling locations. The mean concentration we detected of dieldrin is also the highest mean concentration yet reported for the North American river otter. And this is consistent with the historical use of the pesticides. What you see is the estimated use of aldrin and dieldrin in 1966 in the United States. Our findings are also consistent with the estimated likelihood of dieldrin in fish exceeding the concerns for fish eating wildlife. Our findings are also consistent with the estimated probability of streams having whole fish samples that exceed a level of dieldrin that corresponds to the EPA screening values for a cancer risk of 1 in 10,000. So knowing all of this, how do fish consumption advisories in Illinois compared to other states? For example, in a specific stream in Delaware, because of concerns about dieldrin, there is the advice that you should not consume more than one meal per year. And although Illinois has fish consumption advisories for polychlorinated biphenyls, chlordane, and mercury, Illinois does not have fish consumption advisories for dieldrin. Thank you.